Specialists, culture drives human development more than hereditary qualities. By University of Maine. In another examination, University of Maine analysts found that culture assists people with adjusting to their current circumstance and conquer difficulties preferable and quicker over hereditary qualities. In the wake of leading a broad survey of the writing and proof of long-haul human advancement, researchers Tim Waring and Zach Wood presumed that people are encountering a exceptional developmental progress, in which the significance of culture, like learned information, practices and abilities, is outperforming the worth of qualities as the essential driver of human advancement. Culture is an undervalued factor in human development, Waring says. Like qualities, culture assists individuals with acclimating to their current circumstance and address the difficulties of endurance and generation. Culture, be that as it may, does as such more viably than qualities on the grounds that the exchange of information is quicker and more adaptable than the legacy of qualities, as per Waring and Wood. Culture is a more grounded system of transformation two or three reasons, Waring says. It's quicker. Quality exchange happens just once in age, while social practices can be quickly scholarly and often refreshed. Culture is additionally more adaptable than qualities. Quality exchange is inflexible and restricted to the hereditary data of two guardians, while social transmission depends on adaptable human learning and adequately limitless with the capacity to utilize data from companions and specialists a long ways past guardians. Therefore, social development is a more grounded sort of transformation than old hereditary qualities. Waring, a partner teacher of social natural frameworks demonstrating, and Wood, a postdoctoral exploration partner with the School of Biology and Ecology, have recently distributed their discoveries in a writing audit in the Proceedings of the Royal Society B, the leader organic examination diary of the Royal Society in London. This exploration clarifies why people are a particularly exceptional animal categories. We develop both hereditarily and socially after some time, yet we are gradually getting always social and ever less hereditary, Waring says. Culture has impacted how people endure and advance for millennia. As indicated by Waring and Wood, the mix of both culture and qualities has energized a few key transformations in people like decreased hostility, agreeable tendencies, cooperative capacities and the limit with regards to social learning. Progressively, the analysts propose, human transformations are directed by culture, and expect qualities to oblige. Waring and Wood say culture is likewise uncommon in one significant manner. It is emphatically bunch-arranged. Variables like congruity, social personality and shared standards and organizations, factors that have no hereditary same, make social development very gathering-focused, as indicated by scientists. Accordingly, rivalry between socially coordinated gatherings drives variations, for example, new agreeable standards and social frameworks that assist bunches with enduring together. As indicated by analysts, socially coordinated gatherings seem to tackle versatile issues more promptly than people, through the intensifying worth of social learning and social transmission in gatherings. Cultural transformations may likewise happen quicker in bigger gatherings than in little ones. With bunches essentially driving society and culture presently powering human development more than hereditary qualities, Waring and Wood found that advancement itself has become more gathering-focused. In the extremely long haul, we recommend that people are advancing from individual hereditary creatures to social gatherings what work as super-organisms, like insect provinces and bee colonies, Waring says. The general public as living being allegory isn't so allegorical all things considered. This knowledge can assist society with bettering people can find a way into an efficient and commonly valuable framework. Take the COVID pandemic, for instance. A viable public pestilence reaction program is genuinely a public insusceptible framework, and we can accordingly gain straightforwardly from how safe frameworks work to further develop our COVID reaction.